In a land we share with other human beings. Where you are not the only person on this planet. Fitness centers are numerous. It's a public space and we can all do our part to live by this one sentinel code. Every time I go to the gym, without fail, something frustrating, annoying, downright ugh, happens. And these are my six things. No, this is not a endless list. This is not exhaustive. This is my six things, only six. Have to reel myself in. Six things for gym etiquette that you need to work on. Number one, and my biggest pet peeve, put your weights back. We're not your babysitters, put your weights back. Are you strong enough to take them out? Are you strong enough to put them back? It's not my job to clean up your mess. Dumbbells, barbells, whatever it is, it's my hell, okay? I've tripped on it before, it gets in the way. What are we, five? I just... Ugh. Number two, listen closely. Don't hog machines. If I'm finishing three sets of a workout before you finish one, speed it up a little bit. Hey man, how many more sets you got? A lot. Like, a lot. It's a public space. Maybe there's only a couple of that machine or that dumbbell weight or whatever. Be mindful. Other people want to use it too. Even if they don't say anything, they're probably lurking around the periphery waiting to get in there. Be mindful. I've seen people sitting there texting or Snapchatting or selfieing and it's not cute, it's not fun because we're all in there to get a sweat going, get fit, stay active, pow pow. Please don't hog machines. Number three, very similar to number two, but don't colonize machines. What are we, Great Britain? You don't need to use six machines at once, two, three machines at once, whatever. I know I'm on a soapbox, but, and I understand the importance of doing a superset, getting your workout done, however you wanna do it, especially during like peak hours. If you're going when it's like, everyone's getting off work or everyone's before work, trying to get their workout in, you don't need to be hogging the Smith machine and the leg press at the same time, and you're squatting and doing leg press at the same time. Come on, no bueno. <laughs> Ooh, this one. Number four, clean your machines. It's very easy. And if you need a lesson, let me give you a lesson. Step one, get some paper towels or whatever it is, whatever your gym has. Step two, get the spray bottle. Very simple, make sure that's turned on. Pro tip. Step three, spray the paper towel with the cleaner. Go wipe the machine. That's it. Do it. Especially now, like there's viruses. I mean, there's viruses all the time, but I've actually got ringworm from gym equipment, gym machines, you know, it's not fun. You gotta put a cream on it and it looks gross. And no, ringworm isn't a worm, it's a fungus. And yes, it's fine. It's all cleared up and it looks great. Please clean your machines. I don't wanna feel your sweaty nastiness all over the machines. Mm -mm. No, thank you. No, thank you. Okay, number five. Don't stand in front of others when they're trying to work out in front of the mirror. Using the mirror as a form check for yourself and a little bit of vanity is nice. The mirrors at the gym serve a purpose. And if you stand in front of someone else who's at the mirror, near the mirror, working out in front of the mirror, you know what I mean. You're telling them, hey, what I'm doing is more important than what you're doing. I'm gonna stand here. All right, number six, 
let's finish this list off real strong. Don't stand right in front of the dumbbell rack. Please don't do it. That's valuable real estate at the gym. I don't wanna have to say, excuse me, when I'm going to get dumbbells. Please don't stand there. I feel like it's a safety thing too. Could be doing flies or pressing stuff while I'm walking by and I hit you or you hit me by accident and bada boop -bidi beep -bidi bop bada. Have some courtesy. Be aware of your surroundings. Jazz hands that you're even going to the gym. I love it. Get fit. Stay healthy. Yes. Just be mindful of others. It's a public space and gym etiquette is so, so important. Like I said, this is only six things. I could come up with so many more. The things that I see at the gym is just, but still. Have some gym etiquette. Maybe I'm OCD. Maybe I'm just a little too uptight about these things. But please, if you've noticed anything and you have any other gym etiquette points, please tell me. After all, the gym is a great place for community. You meet great people. You have a great workout. Just do it in a mindful way. That is it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. And I hope to see you in the next one.